everyone, this is Ranger Rob from the Ranger Rob Country Living Channel. Welcome to the channel. I uh, got a lot of new subscribers. Love the meet ya. And uh, don't be afraid to say hello in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. Good, bad, or indifferent. As long as you're polite and a professional, we'd love to hear from you. So, uh, my son's kind of in a funny spot here. I'm taking you for a walk. And uh, I want to talk about homesteading a little bit. So, uh, I think I did a video yesterday, or yeah, I think it was. I think it was called Woke or Awake. And uh, someone called me a nasty word. <laughs> A right-wing conservative. Well, that's okay. Uh, sometimes I can be on all sides of stuff, and I, that's okay. Uh, the only thing I always find is when someone might not totally agree with something I say and stuff, and that's okay. That's what the comments area is for. They always have to be rude or have to use vile language or something. Where the other folks are usually really polite. And it happens every time. And my only uh, answer to that is uh, when they have to go that far, it probably means they've lost the debate while they have. Um, instead of just having a, a normal conversation. But, um, Pro-con and whatever we talk about here, but uh, homesteading. Uh, let us bring it back to the homesteading. Homesteading is being self-sufficient. Homesteading is family, working together, working with the land, working with animals and pets, and uh, uh, being uh, self-sufficient, self-reliant, and not really. Someday we may have a crisis and we know we can't depend on our government and so uh when we talk about different things about whether you're woke or awake or are you paying attention to things or are you a man or uh are you uh eating at the dining room table together um those all contribute to a homestead and uh the other thing i haven't noticed a whole lot of is homesteaders that are left-leaning <laughs> uh, woke pe people uh, but I you know I could be surprised and actually that'd be great I'd love to see that so I brought you to the back part of our property how's it look looks pretty brown doesn't it brown we have sage we have uh, junipers a uh, little bit of cheat grass dogs love coming back here because the deer go through here and stuff but look at this property not what you would call ideal dirt or soil, is it? Uh, but what if two ways of going? What if I came in here and leveled it all off, uh, spent thousands of dollars on uh, uh, amending the soil? What would this turn into? And added water. Or what if I didn't amend it, spend thousands of dollars on that, and I put a Idaho pasture pig on here, then maybe a cow, then maybe some uh, free-ranging chickens. What would happen to this land, of the, this part of our property? My other part of the property is over there. You always see it from there. You're now in one of my outside pieces. I have about two acres out here. But what if I turn this into something that had pasture in it? What if I seeded it and what if i watered it occasionally what if i put animals in here to work the dirt and add manure to it and scrape it and do their magical thing and over a couple of years i wonder what this property would look like back here and of course what i'm talking about is permaculture and uh, i'm new at it i'm no expert lots of channels talk about it uh, there's lots of resources to learn about it, but uh, doesn't this look kind of barren? Does this really look like something that would grow something? The answer is it can, but it takes 
working the property, the soil, uh, and uh, let nature set it up for me to uh, to be something that's productive and uh, everlasting by using animals. And uh, that's something I'd like to do out here. And, I, and it's definitely something I want to add to with home uh, homesteading is not only strengthen the family, be more self-reliant, but also caretakers of our of your land and uh, I also feel like it'd be nice to have our land do some work work for us as we amend it so uh, we'll have to see how that goes and, and I have more land over on the other side uh, it's kind of like an L shape and uh, it's quite a quite a bit of room here about two acres of land I'm not using and it's just this I think I'd like to put it to work. What do you think? So uh, I'm actually at the other part of our property and this side, a house is over there. <laughs> I, can't, I can't find our property lines. And uh, once again, pretty barren land, isn't it? Uh, down here, this is the front of our property. There's a big post in the ground. Makes it real clear where the line is, but uh, I couldn't figure out where it was at the other side. This give me a general idea. Uh, but yeah, it would be really interesting to turn this land into something productive. So there it is. Ah. So over here is the front and this marked with a big pole in the ground. So it kind of gives me a general idea would a look at the other end. But uh, yeah, pretty cool. Of course, my two puppies love running around back here. Come on, guys. Let's go. Come, come, come. And we're returning to the regular part of the property, what we call the oasis. And uh, yeah, I thought maybe you get a kick out of seeing what it looks like here in Central Oregon generally before people touch it. Well guys, we just got back from, uh, let's see, looking at bras again. This time she took me to Kohl's and uh, I survived it, but I got my sushi, so that was a good thing. So uh, <laughs> all's good. So uh, tomorrow we leave to go uh, on our tour, go check out the uh, uh, Idaho pasture pig farm in uh, Oregon and that'd be kind of cool and uh, uh, yeah so guys I'm gonna wrap it up right here because uh, we've got a big day tomorrow so uh, please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world we'd appreciate it have a great day and we'll talk to you later bye now our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob poopy bags available at Amazon right now Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.